There's some pepper. Let's get some pepper. Just a little bit of pepper. One, two, three, four, five, six. There you go. All right, sauce is done. But because we're going to heat some of this sauce. We don't sauce, measure here, but we can count. That's right. <laughs> I can count to 10 as many times as I have to. So we're going to take part of this sauce, and we're going to heat it up on the stove because we're going to drizzle it over the end product. And we'll show you that. It's going to be fun. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Taste it. Taste it. Look. There's Aaron. There's Aaron. Hi, Aaron. Aaron doesn't like How to does be it on taste? camera. How does it taste? Mm, it's delicious. It's sweet. Oh, it's savory. It is? I better taste yep. it. Are you ready? Mm, it's not sexy. Mm. All right. Oh my God. So wow. we're going to give Rochelle the, the camera. Hang on. Oh wait. So look, she's going to put about half of it in that pan so we can heat it up. Okay, we're done with that. Put it and on low. Put it on low. I need that to All right, I got to flip. Go ahead. Oh. Well, here, you take this. I will. All right. All right. So for this slaw, I'm gonna go on the other side. Go ahead. I'm gonna go on the other side, people. La 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 la. There's Michael B. People so for the slaw, all we have is half a head of green cabbage, all shredded up. See that? Mm -hmm. Buy organic food, people. Don't forget, buy organic food. You vote with your money. That's yeah, I do need my own show, don't I? I All hear right. ya. And then we've got half a head, a small head of purple cabbage. We have a grated carrot. Super easy, Marcy. It's not intense at all. We have like a third of a bunch of cilantro chopped. And then this. Guess what this is? Do you know what this is, Rochelle? Michelle oh, doesn't yeah, even know. I, know, I know what that is. That's look, carrot greens. Uh, yeah. The ends of carrots. Look, where'd they go? In the fridge. Okay. <laughs> so when you buy a bunch of carrots and they have the greens on them, you guys can eat these. Why are you going to pay extra for the pretty carrots with the greens on them if you're not going to eat the greens? They're good for you too. Right? Lots of vitamins. It's just like the skins on your vegetables and your fruit. That's okay. where a lot of the vitamins are. All right, so putting the greens in. So the this carrots. is the greens from three of those carrots, and then we have one grated carrot. Ta-da! Not easy. Mix, it, mix up. it up a little bit. Look at how beautiful that is. Look at the color. <gasps> Ooh. Oh. And then just a little bit of that. We're gonna put a little bit of this in. We don't want to overdress it. No. There you right. go. And then here, here's your utensils for tossing it. I thought these were my utensils well, for tossing. Well, you can do whatever you want. <laughs> Look at that. It's beautiful. <gasps> oh my gosh. I think we need a little bit more dressing. I think you're right. A little bit more. Don't overdress it though, people, because... These vegetables are fresh and bright. You want to be able to taste them. There we go. That's better. There we go. Ta -da. Look at that. That was easy. Super easy. Bam. The slaw is done. Look at this, this whole bowl between the vegetables and the yogurt, the spices, everything. Maybe two dollars. Maybe. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Maybe two dollars. Actually, yeah, that's probably right. Accurate. I know. And you can use the yogurt. You're using the yogurt for two things. Okay. So. All right. I'm gonna put the rest of uh, the this dressing in this pan. Okay. Okay. So we've got our yogurt heating up. We've got our onions caramelized. Aaron says it smells so good in here. <laughs> Aaron? Aaron! <laughs> Cassie! Mm -hmm. And Michael! <laughs> All these smiling All right. faces in our house. Okay, I need to come over there and help you because you have to get lickety split started on the. Here, thank you, Michael. I'm going to sneeze. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Thank you. Excuse me. 
Let me rinse my hands. Ta-da! I'm back. <laughs> How'd you do that? <laughs> I'm magic. <laughs> Magic. Okay. By the way, our featured beer tonight is uh, from Pelican Brewing Company in Gold Coast, Oregon. It's a Cascadian Pilsner. We like just it? discovered it yesterday. We like it a lot. We discovered it because it was on sale, and uh, <laughs> we buy our beers on sale. Look at that slaw. Look at the colors in there. Yeah. It's beautiful. It's gonna right. okay. The slaw is ready. The yeah. sauce is heating up. Yeah. So we have these uh, sweet potatoes that we boiled earlier. You got to cut these up just a little bit. They can be in big chunks, and we boiled them for about fifteen or twenty minutes, so they'd be soft. We have about a cup of black beans. These are organic black beans. They're out of a can. I would rather you buy organic black beans in bulk, soak them yourselves, oh, can yeah. them, but you know, we're just trying to teach you that uh, that you can do this. And vegetables are yummy. We don't cook with anything that wasn't in your grandmother's pantry. That's right. That's like our rule of thumb. If my grandma would cook with it, except for spam, sorry guys, <laughs> can't eat the spam. I'm gonna add a little bit of salt. There, you go. there we go with our salt. Okay. So we got this pretty mashed up. And okay, we left the skins on the yams because most of the vegetables and fruits you eat, the majority of the nutrients are in the skins. All right. Oh, did we talk about why we're doing this meal? Yeah. We're doing this meal because our friend Shane, he recently. Well, I don't know how recently, but anyway, he can't eat meat anymore. Yeah. And he's having to learn how to eat a vegetarian diet. Sweet potatoes are a superfood. There's like a complete or almost complete complement of amino acids just in the sweet potatoes. Black beans also are a high source of protein. So if you're not eating meat anymore, you need the protein. There you go. Okay, let's throw in the... Barley. All for right, texture. now we have about a cup of barley. We're throwing that in for texture. Again, barley is another good source of protein. So you got three sources of protein in here. We're just going to give that a little mix. And the then, barley adds texture because your body these are these are textures your body is familiar with, and your mouth will love. Right. And then we're going to throw in some Greek yogurt as a binder. Right. We're not using any eggs. You could use eggs. Yeah, this is great. If you just can't eat meat, but this right now this is up until then it was a vegan recipe. Yeah. There you go. All right, mush it together. So just give it a quick mix. The yogurt is going to help keep everything. It's a binder, like she said. It's going to keep every everything together while it's uh, fried. That. All right, look oh, at that. That's beautiful. There we go. Okay, and then you just take a piece of wax paper because it's going to be kind of mushy. Let's put it up here. Yeah. All right, so I have one piece of wax paper here, and then I'm going to take a glob of it and another glob like that. Those are technical kitchen witch terms. Yes, globs, globs, dollops, whatever. Yeah. All right, and then I just fold it over and gently press and form it just like that. Super easy. Turn it over do the same thing. Mm -hmm. Just like a burger. All right? Look at that. Super easy. Then, as an added fun thing to do to make it a little crispy on the outside, we put Parmesan cheese on the outside over here. Now Press it in. Press it in just a little bit. Flip it over. Voila. All right? Da 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 da. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Okay, and there you go. Now, over here in this frying pan over here, we've already started two. They are yeah. they are done. And in there we put, Look. they're done. Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. Mm. Okay. Look at. Look at that. Oh, yeah. That Isn't is... that gorgeous? And this is just a little bit of olive oil, butter, and some of that canola oil. Mm -hmm. Just uh, so that we can cook it a little hotter. Yeah. So then when I'm okay. put, put on the pan, I peel it off like that with that lever. 
And you just drop it in there. Ta-da! You're done. Look at there that. You see drop it? it in there. How long did you cook it? Like seven or eight minutes. Seven or so, like five minutes. Flip it over another yep. three or four minutes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now we're gonna dress this. Okay, so that you can see how delicious it's gonna be. So you take some of your some of your slaw. Wait. Oh. Wait. Wait. Do you want to put the slaw on first? No, we were we were gonna put. Oh, that's right. Because we have the same dressing that was in the slaw, except it's warm now. So we're just going to put a little bit on there, right? Mm. Look at that. Ooh. Oh, yeah, and some. And then... Caramelized onions. we got the caramelized onions. These happen to be sweet Maui onions, but whatever kind of onions that you like or whatever you can get that's organic, buy those. So there we go. All right, and a little bit of slaw. How much? That, that much? Put that on there, let's see. <gasps> Look at that. A little yeah. more. A little more? Okay. We want them to get full. Yeah. <gasps> Look there at you that. Go. Bam. See how easy that was? Beautiful. Isn't that You gorgeous? guys can do this. Mm -hmm. So easy. There's restaurants that would charge mm -hmm. you $32 for that plate. And guess what? You can do it yourselves. Guess what? We forgot to tell them the most amazing part. Which part? You can make this ahead of time because... Oh, that's right. Yes. Yeah. We did it. We made okay. extra. So you can make your you can make your mash, right? You can wrap it up in saran wrap. Look. So exciting because you can have some more for another day. You put it in the freezer. Then when you're ready to use it, you just unroll it. You can cut it and you got like steaks or burger or whatever yes. you want to call it. Pancakes, right, mm -hmm. right there. And you can do that with any um, potato recipe that you want. You can just make it up ahead of time, roll it up, slice it as you want it. So. It's so easy. If See, you learn. Try, look at how delicious that looks. If you gain the, the uh, confidence, you can come in one day a week. You can spend four or five hours in your kitchen. Which is fun, because being in the kitchen Bring great. the kids in, bring your spouse in, do it for yourself, whatever. Make it a family affair. And then you have saved yourself so much time all week long. You come home from work, you're tired. You already did the work. It's in the fridge. It's in the freezer. Yep. Right? You're not buying that processed food. I don't know if you guys have noticed in any of our videos, there is no microwave in this house. None. Zero. No microwave. No microwave. We, we won't buy anything that only that has microwave only directions. Okay, so right? we need to let these Look people go, but this All is right. delicious. Shane, this is for you. I love you. All right, come join us in Mount Shasta City, the Mount Shasta City Vets Club tonight. Yep. We're going to dance with Synergy and Kelly Vibes. We love you all. What's the rule? <gasps> if you leave here hungry, it's your own fault. All right, we love you. Bye.